What's going on, guys? I'm Killer Cross, and I'm here with DJ Dells and Mr. Jones. Oh, Killer Cross, how you doing, bro? Let me ask you, man, how how long did it take you to grow out that fabulous set of hair you got up there, man? I feel like Two just weeks. a couple weeks ago you were both. Two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> you said you were a fan of K1. Yes. Um, throwback K1, Mirko Krokop. Um, Andy Hoog. Andy Hoog. Stefan Lako. Yes. Who, what's one of your favorite matches you saw in the K1 era? That you, that, you, that you can remember that you liked the most? It's not that it was the best match, but my favorite match to watch was Mirko Prokop versus Bob Sapp when he yes. broke Bob Sapp's orbital phone. Not that I dislike Bob Sapp, but it was just a crazy fucking freak fight. Where are you ever going to see fights like that ever again in your life? Absolutely nowhere. What's up? It's Sammy, the Spanish guy, Guevara, and you. Right now, you're watching DJ Zells and uh, Mr. Jones. Oh, Got it, right bro. Right there, one and done. Sammy, those are dope. I've noticed you've uh, really turned up your sneaker collection. Both of you guys have. The yeah. Marina the Marina Blue one, she's got some fresh Gucci's on. He's got some mids. She, uh, she also wore those in her street fight. There was uh, thumbtacks in them before. What's up, guys? I am the champ, champ, and the virtuosa, and I am hanging with DJ Dells and Mr. Jones today. What's up, guys? That's what's up, yo, champ, champ, the out of process. <laughs> Can I ask you, what are you, um, what are you listening to these days on your playlist? Ooh, um, I am a big country music fan. Really? That's what I listen to all day, every day. Yeah. Um, Tim McGraw, always oh, my go-to, always. No, really, Tim McGraw. <laughs> yeah. Tim McGraw, heavy, huh? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's, that's a little bit different from what, uh, what, what your fiance Steve would say. He's you know? a Metallica fan, that, that rock. Um, that's a little before my time. Uh, but we, we must want to make sure of everything in the house to make us both happy. Johnny Gargano, I'm hanging out with DJ Dells and Mr. Jones. Oh, Johnny, man, I know you're a huge uh, comic book guy. Yes. Who's your favorite comic book character for those who don't know? My favorite comic book character of all time, I'm a big comic book collector, uh, is Spider Man. So Spider Man. I pick one and be Spider Man, yeah. You buy, um, I changed, have you, you, yeah, did you like the last Spider Man? Was that like really good? Did you watch the one? Spider Man No Way Home? Yes. Yeah, Spider Man No Way Home, if I had to choose one MCU movie of all time, I'd say that's probably my favorite of all time. No questions. No. Awesome, I love that. May I, may I ask you another question? Um, what uh, what DC movie or Marvel collab would you like to see that hasn't been done? So I'd say probably, just because it's James Gunn, uh, something with Peacemaker or, just in general, the Suicide Squad, his version of it with the Guardians of the Galaxy would be pretty fun. It's the Flood Stud, Johnny Drip Drip, a.k.a. John Morris, and right now I'm hanging out with... DJ Dells and Mr. Jones. Howdy, what was it like working with uh, Bad Bunny, man, in the ring? You know what? There's been no celebrity, I think, with WWE that's been as much of a fan and worked as hard as that dude. Uh, I understand why he's successful at what he does. Really? Yeah. And what, what was it like making that? Talent. What was it like making that music, that, that diss track about Bad Bunny? Didn't your cousin lose to a I tortoise? Love, I love. Believe it or not. I love singing, I love rapping. I, I'm not necessarily musically gifted, but I, I still like doing it. Yeah, that was great, man. But the Spanish yeah. was my favorite, because Miz couldn't say the Spanish part. Right. Like, Whoa. Yeah. And like, Miz tried to learn it. No. Was it happening? Not happening. That's great, brother. That's absolutely awesome. So were you built with? Were you born with abs like that, or did, did, did that take a lot of hard work and dedication, man? Um, hard work and dedication. Yeah. But I've always been a hard gainer. In high school, I wrestled at 103 because I couldn't make the football team because I was too small. Really? So putting on weight has always been my challenge. Yeah. Until now, of course. Now I <laughs> like diet and do cardio like everybody. Oh, absolutely, brother. The Varsity Blogs. We're hanging out with DJ Dells and Mr. Jones. What's going on? Hey, everybody. Hey, I'm with the Varsity Blogs. What's up, fellas? Brian, you, yeah, I know you're from Cincinnati. How are the, uh, what do you think about the Bengals? How well, far you do you know, think I they mean, can... My hometown, I've never seen them go that far, and they made it all the way to the dance, so... Hold on, hold on. Fuck the Bengals. <laughs> it's all about the Rams, baby. Matthew Stafford, Cooper Cup, let's you go. You didn't mean to say about the Rams. It's, it's, it's just fine. PG tag team here. Rams, I, baby. Rams? Let's see these guys. We love football. So, so, we so love what do you football. think? What are, what are your predictions for them this year? The Bengals. Oh, we're winning the Super Bowl. Sure. I think they're going to win one playoff game. Then I think the Raiders are going to make a run. I think the Indianapolis Colts are going to make a run. Oh, yeah? But I think the Rams are going to make a run and go back to back. Brian, 
No. I don't know why he's a Rams fan. He's not from LA. No, no, no. no. <laughs> the Rams fans if they were in St. Louis. No, he yeah. is. He's not. Right, what do you think about the Cincinnati Reds? They're terrible. They're terrible. It's <laughs> <laughs> uh, Cincinnati Reds. I hate baseball. What about the Bearcats? Cincinnati Bearcats. I hate baseball. I love the Bearcats. Love the Bearcats. They turned out to be all right this year. Yeah. But the Bengals. It's, a, it's all about. It's all about. Shitting on Cincinnati, but Cincinnati, Cincinnati. What's the difference? What's going on? It's your boy Trey Miguel, Spider Trey, the X Division champ, the Fresh Division champ. I'm hanging out with the sneaker addict himself, DJ Dells, and Mr. Jones. What we got going on today? We're yeah. sitting here signing, we're taking pictures, selling shirts, putting some paint where it ain't. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yo, Trey, man, let me ask you a question, man. Yeah. You got the uh, the Hyper Royals? We got some Hyper Royals. The Hyper Royals on today? I like those. What's the, uh, what, what, what do you prefer, Jordans or Dunks? Jordans all day. Jordans, Jordans all, all day. day now, what's your favorite? A pair of Jordans in your collection? In my personal collection, my ooh, probably my OG Shadows. OG Shadows? Yep. Really? Yep. Now those rebellion airs just came out recently with the X on the back and they fair the OG Shadow. I I like those rebellion airs. If the, if I could change one thing about it, I would take the writing off the black. I would leave the writing on the gray. That looks cool, but the 3M on the black, that shit looks like after a hot like a wear in the hot summer, bro. Like that's gonna peel maybe. I don't and I don't know what the leather con like uh, quality is under that either. So I already got the OG shadow. I'ma chill with that. If I feel like I need an accent, I'll paint my own red X on the back. My of that. man, <laughs> my man, I like that. What's the shoe, uh, what's the sneaker you're looking forward to getting? It's All coming right. out soon that you want to add to your collection. Okay, so big fan of Air Jordan 1s. I had a pair of OG breads that were pre-owned that I was like, I can't stand feeling someone else's fucking footprint in my, in my soul. So a dude gave them right off his feet to me, and I sold them for $600. i am about to buy... A DS pair of them bitches back. Really? But for new releases, I'm probably gonna. I'm not a huge fan of the 85s, but that we got a Chicago 85 coming out in December this year. So that's the holy grail right there. I don't own the Chicago. I own the origin story Spider-Man one. I wore them yeah, to the gym this morning. Rallies. Yep, yep. I got those. But that's the closest thing to the Chicago one that I got. So I'm gonna grab the 85, and then when I real, if I feel like that's not quite doing it, I'm gonna just cough up the two grand and get me a real pair. No doubt. <laughs> no doubt. What you think about those Georgetown 85s? It just came those out recently. Cool. They look hard though. Yeah. Like like hard Tough. to wear. I, I mean, like physically hard. They look like you can't bend. You feel like wearing a brand new Air Force One. If you own a pair of mid tops, you know what I'm talking about, bro. Yes, 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 we do. <laughs> trying to break them in is crazy. That's what's up. It's like cracking an arthritis knuckle. It just ain't popping, my boy. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Hit the thumbs up button. Shout out to Mr. Jones on location doing his damn thing. And thank you to everyone that joined us on the vlog. And Make sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, because those are just basically snippets of interviews. So be on the lookout for them all. Subscribe, hit the notification bell, follow Infamous Mr. Jones on Instagram and Twitter, and follow me at DJ Dells on Instagram and Twitter too. Catch you guys soon. Leave them comments, share, and if you're watching on the playback, you should be, hit one of the boxes. Watch more here at The Dell Show. We out.